Welcome to Nar Shada, Hunter. Sleaziest place in the galaxy. Your target is the Eidolon, a professional assassin with a right scary reputation. Branded himself as the assassin who could kill absolutely anybody. For the right price, of course. Spent several years proving it, too. His background is a mystery, but he used to do a lot of work for the Hut Cartel. I'd suggest looking up Gellerin, a Twi'lek who works for the Cartel. Word is he hates the Eidolon more than just about anybody. Oh, and when you find your bounty hunter rival, give him my best before you blast him to pieces. Happy hunting. Arshadaw. I always knew I'd find my way back here, just didn't picture it quite like this. You're from Narshada originally? Yep. Grew up on the streets. Those were some nasty times. Then Braden took me away from all that. A few things you should know. The Hut Cartel pretty much runs this place, with the Exchange and various gangs trying to carve out their own peace. Krista mentioned Gellerin might help us track down the Eidolon. I remember that Twi'lek. He used to be a scummy slaver, had a bad rep for a real ruthless creep. Let's hope he decides to be cooperative. You'll convince him. You have a way with people. A lot of things might have changed while I was away. Let me track him down. Should we head to the promenade and see what Galleron has to say? Worthless slug to a rancor if I have to. You hear what? Hey, excuse me? Hey, nobody just walks in here, huh? Nobody. I'm a bounty hunter, hunting the Eidolon. Interested? The Eidolon? What? You're kidding me, right? No. <laughs> Tell me you're kidding. You're, you're not kidding. All right, I'll bite. Boys, hey, get out of here. Get us some refreshments. The Eidolon did some work for us, you know. He could kill anybody, anywhere. This guy was unbelievable. Killing folks ain't that hard. Anyone could kill a gank on the street. But the Eidolon specialized in impossible targets. But then, at the top of his game, the Eidolon announces he's getting out of the assassination business. Opened a security company. Suddenly, half the corporations here were clients of Eidolon security and we're no longer paying the hut cartel. Hey, Gellerin, I haven't finished slicing those casino lugjack machines, but I thought that... Anoli? That's Mako! Everyone said she was dead! The Rodian brothers grabbed her! Someone saved me from those antenna heads, Anoli. My good friend, he took me away to Huda. You two know each other? Anuli and I grew up together on the streets. He's like my little brother. Can we get back to business? Yes? Look, nobody knows how to find the Eidolon, but if you hurt his company, he'll find you. I've seen it before. The Eidolon's biggest client is the Republic. Eidolon Security supplies those ganks with billions of credits worth of munitions every year. Is Eidolon Security actually allied with the Republic? It's a business. It allies with the biggest bank account, and the Republic's got a pretty impressive one. Eidolon Security's got a stockpile of munitions bound for the Republic Army. Crates are at their manufacturing facility in the Karelian sector. If that facility were to blow up, the Eidolon would owe the Republic billions of credits, which I'm guessing, hey, he ain't got just lying around. Can't use thermal detonators. Too small. Need beradium charges, like the ones Brel made before he blew up. Hang on, hang on. Wait, hey, you're hearing that out of context. Brel blew himself up because he got cocky. These beradium charges are perfectly safe. You got my word. Fine. Hand them over. That's the spirit. Ha! I wish I had a dozen of you working for me. Uh, uh, you know, with me. The charges are magnetic. You gotta put them on the power generators for maximum yield. One in the control center, too. A facility that size will have several generators. It's pretty standard. They'll be easy to spot. The charges are on a synchronized timer. Now, after you planted the last one in the control room, set the timer, then get out of there. Stop. I've been watching you on the surveillance monitors. I know what you're doing. You've got to stop. Please. There are dozens of civilian technicians and engineers working here. If you blow up this facility, they'll all be killed. Maybe they should be getting out of here then. Our security chief disabled the evacuation alarm. They don't want this attack made public. I only need a few minutes to round up my crew and get them out of here. Do what you will afterwards. Do it. Hurry. Thank you.
Did you feel it? Huh? <laughs> the idolized property will rain down on the streets for days. I could already hear his holo conversation with the Republic. Were those our billions of credits going up in smoke? <laughs> Maybe the Eidolon will ask you for a loan. <laughs> yeah, I'd give my left leku to see that gang beg me for credits. I got some discretionary funds from the cartel to deal with these sorts of problems. I think you've earned more than a few. The hunters gotta know. Galloran should talk about it. Mako said it was important. She said so. Wait, what did you find, Anumi? Oh, for the love of frying and credits, we're discussing business here. Strange weapon orders. Armor plating, blaster cannons, defense shields. Shipped to an abandoned warehouse in the Dural sector? Makes no sense. Armor plating. Hang on, that sounds really familiar. Let me check something. Sounds like bad news. I asked Inui to help me watch for possible bounty hunter rivals and to look out for anything weird. And this is, even for Nar Shada. Nobody ships expensive hardware to empty buildings. Or if they do, they hide it better. Here it is, the Zargnor clan. I knew those weapon parts sounded familiar. The clan of Ugnaughts got into the Great Hunt by building a bizarre war droid that they would ride inside of. The thing's blaster cannons blew up during the Grand Melee. Everyone was killed except the Ugnaughts inside the armored droid, making them the winners. I'm surprised an entire clan counts as one hunter. Maybe they count by weight. Hey, as possible rival bounty hunters go, these might not be too bad. Assuming they haven't finished their new war droid, but it'd probably be a good idea to get them before they finish. Time to go to work. The warehouse they ship the parts to is in a really sketchy part of town. It'll be tough to get to. Look, hey, I don't know what this is about, and I don't think I want to know. Take care of your personal business when you get back and chat more about the item. <laughs> I'm a bounty hunter on the Great Hunt. My feelings exactly. No more problems? Huh? Good. Good. My people are looking for signs the Eidolon is on the move. So far, it's quiet. I think he's watching. Maybe we didn't hurt Eidolon security enough. Nah, that part's easy enough to fix. <laughs> See, if I get rid of the Eidolon, the cartel makes me a full-fledged boss with my own clan. And all we gotta do is take out one little assassin and his pet corporation. What a fragged deal, huh? Mako said the hunter will take me away from here. I help find the Eidolon, I get off Narshada. Mako said so. If that's the deal Mako made, I'll honor it. Thanks. This means a lot to me. I'll owe you one. Now that's settled, let's get back to the job of driving Eidolon security out of business. One of Eidolon security's slogans is, Your secrets are our secrets. So what if you were to make all those confidential records public? It has potential. Potential? What, you friggin' kidding me? Just picture this. Every contract, every shady deal, all the security specs of every single one of the Eidolon's clients at anyone's disposal. Hey, Anuli, what do I pay you for, huh? How do we put Eidolon security's records on the holonet? Oh, that's real hard. Eidolon's holonet transceivers are in the network access sector. Heavily guarded. You gotta slice into those to get to their records. But gotta get past these encryption programs first. You need Z's codes from him. Also a top-notch slicer to access Eidolon's network. Z's a Bith engineer, best holonet security expert money can buy. He won't just give you those codes. 
Where do I find Z? Z's currently consulting for a Republic company called Nebula Communications. I'd suggest you blast your way into Nebula's corporate office in the industrial sector, grab some security slug, force him to tell you where Z's at. Why are you doing at? this? We don't keep a lot of credits here. I'm looking for a bit security officer named Z. The Holonet security guy? Is he in trouble? I've got a gun at your face, and you want details? Right. What am I saying? Z's at the Imperial Spaceport. He's on his way to Mechas 3 for a business meeting. He's probably already gone. I gave you what you wanted. You're not gonna kill me, are you? Which makes you a coward. I hate cowards. Didn't even like working here. He's going to talk about Bombo Gita Kum Bosca Bulia? I want all of the data on Eidolon Security's encryption program. Now! You don't want to resist me on this one. Will you keep quiet about our little chat? This will be our only meeting. I'm back with Z's codes. Ha! Wish I could have seen the look on Z's face. Anuli, we good? Everything looks legit. Beautiful work. Z's code is like music. Yeah, yeah, whatever. Let, uh, yeah, isolate the ones we'll need and hand the pad back to our hunter friend here. Eidolon Security's transceiver codes are marked. Easy to spot. They'll disable the encryption programs. No problem. Why did I need these codes again? They're going to get you access to all of Eidolon Security's confidential files. Once we get those, the Eidolon's personal business will be everybody's business. <laughs> Eat that, you ganks! <laughs> Okay, so on to phase two of our plan to scrag Eidolon Security's rep and drive their clients away. Anuli? Gotta access Eidolon Security's data transceivers. Input Z's codes, then slice into Eidolon's network, download their files. Here's a holonet transmitter. Once you've accessed Eidolon's network, put this on the transceiver. It'll let Anuli upload the files straight to the holonet. Eidolon Security's entire database is on the holonet. That's bad. Real bad. For them. The transceivers are in the network access sector. Security is going to be tight. And the Eidolon will have his best men protecting those transceivers. Okay, that should take care of Z's no, encryption kill, programs. Baby. Transmitters in place. Let me slice into Eidolon's network. Wow, this is tough. I knew he wasn't kidding. The Eidolon's whole night, guys, know their stuff. It's professional, that's for sure. Lucky we're better. Looks like their clients are getting their money's worth. Come on. Come on. I'm in. I'll contact Nuli. Nuli, are you getting this? That's quite a data stream, huh? Beautiful. All Z's work. A symphony of math. Downloading the files onto the Holonet now. Stand by. Let's get out of here before more of the Eidolon's mercs show up. They're way too good with those blasters. Who put you up to this? Was it the cartel? What if it was? Looks like it's time to eliminate more huts. Good. I hate huts. Eliminate the threat! Now! He's here! He found us! 
prove it. No way to run. He'll find you. He always finds you. We're all dead. Get away. Get away from me. Bingo! No! Ah! We have to get there. We have to save him. I'm not walking into a trap. But it's the Eidolon. You need to kill him. That's the job. That's what we're going to do. Let's just hurry, please. Oh, no. The Eidolon may still be here. Right. Okay. I'm sorry. We need to find Gellerin. He's probably hiding. Assuming he's still... Or was that... What were those things? I can't believe he's gone. I never should have left him. It's all my fault. Again. Try to keep it together. I'm sorry. I'll be okay. Just give me a sec. Look, the whole communicator on Gellerin's desk is blinking. Maybe he's still alive, sending us a message. Oh, there you are. It's been a bit of a challenge tracking you down. I figured you for a rogue agent. But the question was, for whom? I should have known. Galeran's the only one stupid enough to do this. I'm actually a private contractor. Interesting. Galeran's head is being mounted on my wall as we speak. I know he was involved somehow. I must admit, I'm rather impressed that one person could be responsible for so much damage. If you wish to meet me, come to these coordinates. I'll be sitting right here, waiting for you. Of course, the second you step out of the door, you're dead. Shame, really, since our confrontation would have been most exhilarating. Now you'll get to see what bounty hunters are all about. You don't know how much I want that to be true. Well, Hunter, I'm sad to say this is goodbye. Well, here we go. I've... Let's be careful with Who are you? And why are you doing this? I'm not here to talk to you. Fair enough. It was a pleasure to meet you. Opponents like you are very rare and precious. I regret having to kill you. Wait, I've got a priority message from Solash. He's another cartel lieutenant. He's offering a huge bounty if you bring him the Eidolon. Alive. Huts want to do terrible things to you. Oh, come now. You'll never claim that bounty. But then, if we don't have our dreams, what do we have? Come, it's time to die. <laughs> For. You've done it. You've beaten me. Finish it now, and be remembered forever as the hunter who killed the Eidolon. You're mighty proud of yourself, aren't you? I don't lie, and I don't exaggerate. Never had to. Listen to me. I'm appealing to your sense of honor as an equal. Don't hand me over to the cartel. Kill me now. I deserve that much. 
killed your friend. You decide. He deserves to die, but nobody deserves what the Huts will do to him. Give him what he wants. As you wish. Now, I truly am a spectre. You're not like the Eidolon, right? We're different. Do you think I'm an assassin? You kill people for money. How is that different? I can choose to bring them in alive. I wonder if that's any better. Maybe it's worse. I guess we still have work to do. I hope the rest of our targets are nothing like this guy. Should we get out of here? I want to get as far away from Narshada as possible. You'll get no argument from me. Ugh, I told you this place was ugly and My sleazy. intel confirms that. The Hut Cartel just yanked their live bounty on the Eidolon. I have word that you eliminated your rivals as well. Congratulations, Hunter. You've cleared the first round. Your next two targets are on Tatooine and Alderaan. Transmitting your target briefings to you now. Your handler will be pleased to hear they didn't go to waste. Before you move on to your next target, return to Droman Kos. We have something to discuss in private. Luck out. I wonder what that's all about. The Huntmaster's assistant should never communicate with any hunter during a great hunt. It's just not done. Could this get us disqualified? I don't know. The Huntmaster and his representatives have got to be completely neutral. Contacting the hunters could be seen as favoritism. It doesn't sound like we really have a choice at any rate. Better not keep him waiting, I guess.